So I bought an old saw at a yard sale, and I noticed that uh, the female uh, slotted barrel nut was missing uh, to hold the medallion in place. Um, these pieces of hardware consist of a, a male section that has sort of a square head to hold it in place, and then a female uh, slotted uh, barrel nut. So my plan was to take a 20 cent hardware store steel bolt and convert it into one of these slotted barrel nuts. Uh, so I got to uh, change the hex nut head into a round head, put a slot, and then take the uh, the barrel part and turn it down. And then, of course, add a, add a tapped hole. So my first step was to uh, cut the hex screw uh, shorter to sort of match the barrel nut. I left it a little bit longer because it looked like it needed to be to engage the medallion uh, male part better. So after I cut it to length, I put it in my drill press and I drilled the correct size hole uh, so that I can tap the threads. So here I am hand tapping the threads um, with my really, really inexpensive Harbor Freight thread tapping kit. Because the tap was so cheap, I really took my time. I was afraid I was going to break something. I also had to make sure that the the hole I started with was a little bit bigger um, so that I didn't have to remove as much material to make it easier to hand tap. Come on, you can do it. Oh, there, I got it. So here's the hex bolt cut to length with the tapped uh, hole. And I'm using one of the existing pieces of the saw hardware to check the threads. And they worked out all right. Now to shape the outside. So I had the bright idea to chuck the hex uh, bolt into my hand drill and then run the hand drill uh, into the grinder to take the hex away and make it round. Not sure this was the safest way to do this, but it worked. Okay, so you can see now that I have the, the hex head is gone, and now I have a, a matching round head that's close to the same diameter and the same height. I used my Dremel to take away the threads that were on the hex nut and uh, get the diameter down to match the existing barrel nut. I marked a line for the slot for the screwdriver slot, and I tried to use my Dremel with a cutoff wheel to make the screwdriver slot but I found that the cutoff wheel made too narrow of a slot and most screwdrivers wouldn't fit it. So then I went to plan B. Plan B, I just took my hacksaw, followed the groove I already made and opened it up with the hacksaw blade. This gave me uh, a good size slot that more matched the, the barrel nut. So here's a comparison of my homemade uh, barrel nut on the left and one of the existing uh, barrel nuts uh, from the saw on the right. I think it came out pretty good. So here's the saw uh, with the wood handle refinished, the blade sanded down, all the hardware polished up, and I have the screwdriver pointing at my homemade uh, slotted barrel nut. I think she looks great. Thanks for watching.